some sudden feeling of a person. So an interjection means it's a word that expresses the sudden feeling of a person. For an example, surprise, anger, happiness, sadness, so many expressions where we show. Okay, those are, those words are coming under an interjection. Those words comes under interjection. Clear? So an interjection means it's a word that shows some sudden feeling of a Noun or a person. Example. So, the word hooray. So, it will be an interjection can be found by using the exclamatory comma. That is an exclamation comma. Clear? So, hooray. The word hooray means we express our feeling. We express the feeling of joy. So, hooray. Hooray. We won the match. We. We won the match. So, when we win. Okay. When we win something, we will become very, very happy. Then we use the word hooray. It shows that we are very happy. So because we want the match, we are saying hooray. It shows our joyfulness. Means we are very very happy. Next word. Okay, shit. Shit. I missed it. Okay, so shit. The word shit we use when we are very very angry. Or when we are very much surprised. Or when we can't do anything. Okay, when we lose something, we use the word shed. It shows that we are upset. Clear? So shed. I met her, but I could not do anything. Clear? So the next word, alas. Alas should be used when we are very, very sad. When something is missed away, when something is passed. Okay? So alas. The word alas should be used when we are very sad. Alas. Is dead. Okay, so someone is dead and we express our sadness. We express our sorrow. So these are the words and there are other words to express our feelings. Clear? So when we express our feelings, the words where we use comes directly under interjection. Means interjection is an action. Means it's the word that shows the expression or the feeling of a person. Understood children? Yes. I think you all have understood today's class. And don't forget to make sentences out of these four parts of speech. And as today's homework were done by many of you people. So we are very happy. Keep doing it. Keep a book and maintain. When you come back to school, your notes will be corrected. And it will be asked and given to you. So I think you all have understood even today's class. Let's hope for the best. And meet you all tomorrow. Thank you.